There is no greater expression of love than the heroic atonement performed by the Son of God. Were it not for the plan of our Heavenly Father, established before the world began, in a very real sense, all mankind, past, present, and future, would have been left without the hope of eternal progression. As a result of Adam's transgression, mortals were separated from God and we be, would be forever unless a way was found to break the bands of death. This would not be easy, for it required the vicarious sacrifice of one who was sinless and who could therefore take upon himself the sins of all mankind. Thankfully, Jesus Christ courageously fulfilled this, ancient, this in ancient Jerusalem. There, in the quiet isolation of the Garden of Gethsemane, he knelt among the gnarled olive trees, and in some incredible way that none of us can fully comprehend, the Savior took upon himself the sins of the world. Even though his life was pure and free of sin, he paid the ultimate penalty for sin, yours, mine, and everyone who has ever lived. His mental, emotional, and spiritual anguish were so great they caused him to bleed from every pore. And yet Jesus suffered willingly so that we might all have the opportunity to be washed clean through our faith in him, repentance of our sins, being baptized by proper priesthood authority, and through receiving the purifying gift of the Holy Ghost by confirmation and by accepting all other essential ordinances. Without the atonement of the Lord, none of these blessings would be available to us, and we could not become worthy and prepared to return and dwell in the presence of God.